All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back with another game of Beat Rien Fran. This is game 71, and we are joined by the lovely Carly and Taylor. They are sisters from Boston, and they are ready to play us. They are ready to try to beat the champs. Us. We're coming off a loss. Rian and Fran, yeah, we are coming off a loss. I have my rings back, though. You do have your rings back, and my nails are done. So, yeah, so. <laughs> thank, so thank so God. So who knows um, what can happen. Yeah. <laughs> Watch out. Um, welcome <laughs> to the show, guys. Thank you so much for coming on. Thanks for having us. Thank you for having us. Okay, getting into the rules quickly. 15 questions, 15 rounds. If you get a question wrong, the other team can steal the point. Whoever has the most points at the end wins. It's that simple. To determine who goes first, I was going to give us a movie. We have to guess the Rotten Tomatoes score, critics score, whoever is the closest. Your team will get to go first. We will alternate guesses and everybody gets one individual guess. So Noah, what is today's movie today's movie shout out lauren from california greece mm -hmm. greece Lightning. legendary oh, film have you ever seen greece no nope. yes i did in <laughs> school oh. in school interesting i think so yeah that's nice yeah, okay that's so cool. one of you ladies throw out a guess first you want to go first i'm gonna say 87 that is so hot <laughs> that's a that's a good guess. I, yeah, I don't. Sometimes with these old movies, like I don't know where this falls. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 64. I like What'd that. You say? I like that guess. 64. Back to you guys. Oh right, oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, um. I feel like it's actually in between, like 72. Okay. I don't know, should I go low? It can't be low. Is, but is it a critically acclaimed movie? It's Grease. I know. Go, should Grace I just go really just high? Classic, go you know? 90s, yeah, okay. I think. All right, I'm gonna go with 90. Nice. It's 77, oh, so 72 is the closest. Ah, uh, shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn. All right. All right. Good guess. Good guess. That's a good score. Okay. So question number one to Carly and Taylor, and I got an influx of this past week friends and One Tree Hill questions. So I have but, one of but each. But you spread them out. Okay, yes. good. No, I feel, imagine it was just all. You know what? I was in the mirror getting ready this morning, and I was like, fuck. I feel like there's going to be a friends question, and <laughs> I'm not going to know it. <laughs> And we're starting off with one. Good. It'll, it'll be it'll funny when the friends and one trail questions we get wrong. Yep. <laughs> okay. Question number one uh, to Carly and Taylor. Shout out Gabby and Molly from Lunenburg, who those are the girls who you kind of have a rivalry with because yeah. of the Murray thing. Uh, fun little band. But they did say where Team Rhea have been and always will be. They were really hyping you up in this email. They're like, oh. we don't want any smoke with Listen. Rhea. <laughs> <laughs> they don't you want don't, the smoke. You don't yeah. want that smoke. Listen, I love them. I love a fun little back and forth. Yeah. Keeps me alive. And they sent in the Friends question. So uh, this is to Carly and Taylor. In the Friends episode called The One with the Butt, Joey lands a film role and has to play whose butt double? Remember if it's a real actor's name, not the character's name. It's a real I actor. A, I can say that. Actor. Yeah. I feel like it's so random. Like, oh my god! Like, who was? Why is the name the David Hasselhoff 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 coming to my head? Fifteen seconds. I don't know. Honestly, Honestly tell character. What did you say, Noah? Fifteen seconds. Okay. Honestly, no. Like, that's a great. Like, people like that. It's if not so him. Random. I mean, the amount that that's in my head, the Five actual seconds. answer is zero percent. Yeah. So maybe we'll go with that. David Hasselhoff. Incorrect. Oh, I don't okay. know who it is. No. I'm trying to think of somebody that would like be in that like time yeah, period. But also like Joey like, could but, but like be in the episode as mm -hmm. well. Mm. Fuck. Is it like fifteen seconds? Fuck. Oh my god, I don't know. <laughs> is it like George Clooney? <laughs> no, no, no. Tom Cruise? No. Uh, Tom Cruise? John Stamos? No. Oh, I kind of like Stamos. I don't All think right. that's right. Time Let's just go up. John okay. Stamos. John Stamos. Incorrect. It's Al Pacino. Ah! Why didn't we, we go with another Italian? No. Joey's have. Italian. Why would shit. Italian butt match Italian yeah, butt? I know, I know. <laughs> Al Pacino. Shit. I was kind of... Mm, yeah. Freaking idiot I am. All right. All right. It's all right. Shake it off. Shake it off. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Questions coming to us. 
Question number two to re shout out Mackenzie from Kansas City. Who are the two openers for Taylor Swift's Reputation Stadium Tour? Oh my god, I was there. Um, I didn't go to this show. So... Haley Steinfeld? No, she's an actress. No, she does she music. Does, oh, she no, does she's music. a singer. She does music. Haley Steinfeld? 15 seconds. Was it? Haley Kyoko didn't do it, or was she just like... Maybe. Five she seconds. She just like did a guest appearance one time. All right, time's up. Haley Seinfeld and... Can't be two Haley's. Um, Shawn Mendes. Okay, Shawn Mendes. Two, two Carly and Taylor. Shawn Mendes. Okay, okay Charlie XCX is one of them. Oh, is Haim too... Like, is that too yeah, recent? No, yeah, no. no. <laughs> um, I was there, but like, we, Tay and I didn't go to like that first opener. It was like right Okay, up. well, at least you got Charlie XCX. Yeah, well, that gets us nothing. We don't get a point. <laughs> Um, who was like that moment, like at that time? It was like Charlie XCX in like five uh, seconds. Just name a person Haley Seinfeld and Charlie XCX. Incorrect. It's Charlie XCX and Camila Cabello. Ah, Shawn Mendes. Wow, close, close. How do I not remember? Shawn Mendes that? opened up for her on. I want to say maybe like the 1989 tour. It was wild, a while yeah, ago. Yeah, like Shawn Mendes was like popping <laughs> yeah. off at this time. Yeah. You know no, what I don't know. like? That I see a lot of people like Taylor Swift fans kind of like shit on 1989, like online. I don't As if like, I don't oh, like. That. I don't see that. Really? I, I've seen that, a lot of that. Being people like, oh, look at, these ba- look, at, look at these basic fans who like 1989. Like that type of thing. Honestly, 1989 is my favorite call, album. And, call I, me am basic, a, and I am a basic fan. Yeah, so call me basic. I w- <laughs> maybe they're not wrong, but it's my favorite album. Okay. Question number three to Carly and Taylor. Still zero zero. Shout out Shannon from Atlanta. What actor or actress is the common link between these shows slash movies? 30 Rock, Top Gun Maverick, The Unbreakable, Kimmy Schmidt, and Bridesmaids. Those are like all you. It's just one person? One person. I'm not John Hamm. Not. Didn't watch 30 Rock. You didn't? No. Well, there was like everybody in 30 Rock, I think. But it was like... John Hamm. What about that? What about that boy? Or is it the love seconds. interest of Tom Cruise? No. In Top Gun. Jennifer Conley. Wait, what are the two? What are? The, sorry, can you repeat the shows? Five seconds. Thirty Rock, Top Gun Maverick, Unbreakable, Kimmy Schmidt, and Bridesmaids. Don't, don't, Time bridesmaids? is up. John Hamm. Yeah. That's not that. Final answer. Yeah, yeah that's, that's right. Correct. That's right. <laughs> I was like, you guys are, you guys, are, I thought you were going to talk yourself out of that one. That is John, oh my that God. is John Hamm. Really? I didn't yeah. know. Get a guest spot on 30 Rock, Top Gun Maverick, yeah. Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. He was like the cult leader and, um, and Bridesmaids. bridesmaids. You don't forget what he I don't does remember in him in Bridesmaids. No, I don't, that's the part I'm, con- all right. Is he in Bridesmaids? Oh, no, he was, because I looked it up, but, uh. Oh, <clears throat> he's the love interest of um, Kristen Wiig. Yes. 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 yes, yes, yes. Reason Oh, at the beginning. Uh, yeah, yeah. Right yeah. at the beginning. Yeah. Yep. 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 He, he plays like small roles in yep. everything but talk. Yep. Good job. Yay. Nice. Oh, my God. Wow, okay. that was good. One nothing, Carly and Taylor. This is to Rian Fran. Oh, shout out Gabby and Molly again. Um, mm-hmm. In the first season of Grey's Anatomy, the intern who showed the most promise on their first day was chosen to perform a surgery. Out of Meredith's intern group, who was it and what was the surgery? <laughs> Jesus yeah, no. Christ. Not gonna, not gonna Gabby, know that Gabby, Mo- oh, Molly, gosh, guys, come on. Not gonna know that What one. was the surgery? Don't know the what surgery. What are we, doctors? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out who it was. Uh, was it, uh, I wanna say it was, was it- Karev. Was seconds. it? Well, we're not gonna know. I don't think it was Christina or Meredith. All right. So maybe Karev. Five seconds. And a fucking a appendectomy. Or <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Final answer. Incorrect. <laughs> okay, I think it is appendectomy. But okay, of course I just rewatch all of Grey's Anatomy except for the first season. That's so annoying. Um, okay, appendectomy. George. He was it, like no, small and promising. Too- <laughs> too, too, too small new. and promising. They were all new. They were all the interns. 
Oh, no. okay. 10 seconds. Um, Izzy or George? I don't remember any of them doing a surgery. I'm going to say Appy and George. Final answer. Yes. Correct. Oh, shit. <sighs> Appy, you knew that, Fran. That was like always the go to. That person. was always, I, if I, it was just like, that was just a blatant, that was just a straight up guess. Because it's just like an easy. It's just <laughs> a straight up guess on, yeah. on like but that makes picking sense. an intern to do a surgery. It's normally an Appy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, two nothing, uh, Taylor and Carly. And this question is to them. Shout out <clears throat> Shannon from Atlanta again. What were the names of the three popular mean girls in the Princess Diaries? Oh Mandy Moore's character. Stupid Cupid. Yeah. That, that <laughs> uh I have no idea. Sad. I'll never guess that. Oh, don't say, don't say if you only know one or two. Five seconds. No, yeah. I'm just gonna say three names. Um, Karen. No, Lily was a friend. Karen. Cher. Was not a friend. Okay, time is up. <laughs> Karen, Cher, yeah, and Darlene. Fail. Incorrect. Yeah, they sing it. Anna. Yeah. Banna and Montana, like what's what? I'm making up names, but Hannah, Anna, oh, Savannah, I have no idea, not ringing a bell whatsoever in here. Lana, Lana, La Lana. Ten seconds. Anna, and they they all rhyme. Montana, they, they all have names that rhyme. Yeah, Lana, Hannah, and Montana. Lana, Anna, and Montana. Yeah. Incorrect. Fuck. Incredibly close. Shit. You had that one. Lana, Anna, Fontana. Fontana. That's not a fucking name. <laughs> and honestly, oh, my God. in my head, I actually thought I heard Fontana in my head and was like, that can't be right. That's not a name. Fontana. <laughs> well, it is her name. All Damn. right. Shit. You were close. Don't, you were so close. close. I really worked through that one and I'm sad it's I didn't okay. get rewarded. It's all right. You, Still? You can, you're rewarded Damn. from me. What? <laughs> yep. Two nothing still, uh, Carly and Taylor. And this is question number six to Rhea and Fran. Shout out Shannon from Atlanta again. In 2009, Disney Channel's Friends for Change was promoted by a song featuring Miley Cyrus, Demi Lovato, Selena Gomez, and the Jonas Brothers. What is the name of the song? Can you sing it? I'm I trying know. to. Feel like out, the, out loud. On and on. 15 seconds. Swan, one or can build another. Change the world. Five seconds. What's the chorus? What's the lyrics? Time is up. Save the world. Save, Final answer. Save the world. Incorrect. Fuck. Fuck. Oh. I can sing this whole fucking song. So the chorus is, I think it's pass it on. Isn't that what the chorus is? <gasps> Pass it on, right? And that makes that's like yep. a really good Disney message. Do you yep. have anything else? Nope. Pass it on. Final answer. Incorrect. It's also wrong. Yeah. It's send it on. Send it on. Shit. <laughs> and then I was like, pass it on. That doesn't flow. <laughs> send it on. Send on, it on. It on. Damn. Swan start starts a fire. One little action, chain reaction can change mm. the world. Fuck. That sucks. <laughs> All right. Still two nothing, Carly and Taylor, and this is to them. Question number seven, shout out Heather from Chicago. In Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows part two, what phrase do the characters say to share the news that Harry has returned to Hogwarts? Swear to God, if you don't got a Harry Potter question after bullying me to watch it every day of our childhood, <laughs> I should kill you. I can't believe it. Damn. That's so I don't tough. Know, I don't know this either, so. Crazy. I'm like, I'm, I'm a Harry Potter movie peep, so I'm not the... <laughs> that was probably set in a movie. Home. He's back. Harry's, Harry's home. Final He's answer. He's returned. Incorrect. <laughs> it's him. No, <laughs> Harry's a, back. A he's, code, he, uh, he's a code name ha for him. Harry's home. He's back. <laughs> <laughs> it's him. It's the wizard. 
I am used. I I have. There's n nothing going on in my brain right now. <laughs> Just it's like I fog. Nothing. Frick. Ten seconds. I got nothing. Nothing. Yep. Dang it. it. Lightning has struck. Yeah, no. Oh, that makes sense. No, it. Damn. That's, that's it. <laughs> yeah, no. I don't. I'm not recalling that. At Boom. All. Lightning has struck. He's back. Okay. Still too nothing. I, I have faith with the next question. Carly We're Taylor. Get something here. Here's a One Tree Hill question the... for you. Come on, friend. We got this one. Is this yeah. us? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Don't get stuck in the Shout Harry Potter. We're for moving this. forward here. What is the brand that I'm used? I'm gonna be stuck on Send It On. It's gonna be my problem. It's okay. It's, it's okay. What is the brand that used product placement shamelessly throughout One Tree Hill? Fifteen seconds. Man, I'm a naive consumer because I have not noticed. <laughs> is it that? Is it something with like headphones? Five seconds. Is it a, is it a drink? Is it? Is know. it Mountain Dew? <laughs> Time is up. Mountain Dew. I got nothing. Incorrect. <laughs> Close. Sun kissed. <gasps> Final answer. Uh. Final answer. Yes. Correct. Man, you're good. I was and you guys never, have beautiful skin. I was, I've been staring at yeah. it the whole time. Thank you. I do. They're have beautiful smart skin. and they have beautiful skin. Yeah. <laughs> I was never going to get that. It was just like that's you know, that cabin episode in season three when they yeah. go to Rachel's cabin. It's mm, that one episode. Yeah. Like it was the shirt. I also <laughs> think they did like a bunch of wasn't like the one of the the concert series. They did like the fucking sun kissed yes. Peyton was always Concert pushing series. Sunkiss. Man, I love Sunkiss orange soda. Yeah. Okay, three nothing. If we lose two in a row, we may have to take a break. No, no, no. <laughs> we persevere. Okay. And we learn from our mistakes. Three nothing. <laughs> which uh, I can't get a single thing right. Carly and Taylor, Ugh. this question is to them. Shout out Nikki from Chicago. Okay, what's the song? Have faith. Okay. What is the name of SpongeBob's sketch monster and what is his signature sound slash saying? We are not SpongeBob girlies. We just knew, this. We, just knew we were going to get a question like this. Yeah. We were Disney kids. We have no answer for you. I respect Sorry. you guys for that. <laughs> just like a girl household, you know? I don't know. We, we, we Nothing. Not for you. Um, SpongeBob, final answer. <laughs> Incorrect. <laughs> so doodle Bob. It's Doodle Bob. But me, what SpongeBob. You, Doodle, doodle Bob. Bob. Yes. Me, noi, me, noi. <laughs> you wanted all of that, right? You wanted the sound effect. You wanted the saying. You wanted the name. I was. That's right. Final answer. Yeah. 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 Correct. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even have the other part. I just had me, hoi, min, hoi. Yeah. Me, hoi, me, hoi. <laughs> all right. <laughs> me and my sister were. I knew it was Doodle Bob, obsessed. but I did not remember the second part. No joke. There was a time period more recently, and I like to admit, me and my sister would get really high and rewatch those that clip, the Doodle Bob, the Doodle Bob clip, and it was just it was just an yeah. inside joke between us. So, <laughs> the, wow, I, I got one of them. <laughs> okay, three one. Carly and Taylor. This is question number ten to Rhea and Fran. I'm gonna play a movie clip, and you tell me what movie it's from. What? No. What do you mean, no? What's wrong? Well, I'm not gay. Are you sure? I mean, you never really know until you know. No, I'm not gay. Okay, all right, calm down. Look, this, this like, gay panic situation you're having right now, it's coming off a little homophobic. What, I'm homophobic because I don't want a penis in my mouth? Exactly. It's exactly what homophobic means. We're the Millers. Yes. Yes. Great call. Thanks. Yes. She's back in the game. <laughs> All I needed was that SpongeBob. SpongeBob, Doodle Bob, got her going. Okay, three, two, Carly and Taylor. Question number eleven to them. Shout out Alyssa from Kansas City. What is the name of the song that the cast sings at the end of Ella Enchanted? Oh my God! Don't, Don't go, go breaking break my heart. heart. Final answer. Correct. I just sang this on the show like two did weeks you? ago. <laughs> yeah, yes. she did. <laughs> Don't go when I when we were talking about Anne Hathaway getting that new movie, I was like, she can sing "Ella Enchanted." Mm. Don't go break <laughs> my heart. I couldn't if I tried. Okay, four two, Carly and Taylor. This is question number twelve to uh, Rian Fran. Shout out Kelly from Atlanta who sent me an email 
and was like, I have an idea for a new type of question. And I kind of thought it was interesting, so we'll try it out. Okay. On IMDb, four movies are listed for every actor as their known movies, known four movies. What are the, what are three of Ryan Gosling's four known four movies? Oh my god! Yeah. Oh my god! Crazy Stupid Love. Well, how many? La do we, La like, Land. We have to get them exactly. Three out of the four. Okay, La La Land. La La Land. The Notebook. Oh, The Notebook. Yeah, The Notebook. La La Land. And is it one of his like weird action ones? Southpaw. Ten. Ten seconds. I don't hate Crazy Stupid Love. But is that like not enough action? South Paul. Three seconds. No? He wouldn't be known for that? I don't know. Time's up. I've never seen South Paul. All right, can we get four and, and if we name no. three? <laughs> Go with South Paul. <sighs> okay, so, uh, The Notebook, La La Land, and South Paul. Incorrect. South Paul is Jake Gyllenhaal. Yeah. Oh, oh my I god. Was say, yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I was like, I've never seen South Pond. Uh, I don't think he's in that. <laughs> They're so easy to confuse. <laughs> Are they? <laughs> okay, <laughs> kinda. And, but you think it's straight rom coms? He's done other things. I think it would be like Place Beyond really the Pines is at least in there. Successes. For that other one, um, Lou Valentine. That was yeah, very great. And it was a show. Seconds. Maybe we'll put that in. Oh, okay. Crazy Stupid Love. Blue Valentine Lala? Or no, notebook. No, notebook. notebook's the sure. What do you think? Time is up. Time is up. Um, Blue Valentine. The notebook? The notebook and Crazy Stupid Love. Incorrect. The four movies are La La Land, Blue Valentine, Drive, Blade Runner. Wow, the notebook's oh, not even notebook's there? Notebook's not even on there, huh? Crazy. No. What do you guys think of that, <laughs> that question? It's, it's uh, tough. It's, it's not. not and there's no, I don't hate it. I don't hate it, but I don't love it. I wonder what the the criteria is for what those. Because it's are. just like sometimes it's really random. Well, that's what I think the her reasoning Man, was. Man, I can't. Believe I know, I but said how are we supposed no, to like know. know that? Like, she actually wanted you to guess all four. I, there's I no, three. there's no like knowledge element there. Like that's no, a full guessing. Yeah, game. it is. She did say I think she was like maybe this would be better for like more like the the start of the game, Rotten Tomatoes type, or like tiebreaker or something. Yeah, like that. yeah, Not, yeah, yeah. Okay. I can't believe I said Southpaw uh, <laughs> and confused Jake Dylan all Ryan Gosling. I think they are easy, easily confused. I don't think oh, they I look don't. anything alike. Um, they it's don't. not that they look alike. It's just that they're like... I don't even think they really do like similar movie roles. Okay. No, I actually agree with her. There's crossover there for like romance. Same type of and, guy. Like, yeah, like action. they just have the same type Jake of aura Jones to isn't them. A big, like, yeah, I don't know. How many rom com has Jake Jonah done any rom com? <laughs> Love and other drugs. I don't even know mm. what that is. I, never heard I of just it. think they have the same aura. Mm. All right. Okay. Uh question number thirteen. It's still four to Carly and Taylor, and this is to them. Shout out Kirsa from Worcester, Massachusetts. Order these people from most to least Instagram followers. Billy Eilish, Ariana Grande, Beyonce, Justin Bieber. That's so hard. This is another like, really hard. Could one. be literally any. I think Billy has the least out of those people. Beyonce's Insta, like it's kind of like I'm. I think, so, I think Rihanna would have more such than a Beyonce, Beyonce fan, but I wait, think, Rihanna. She's not she's an she's option. <laughs> Our Rihanna, I think, is maybe the most. Yeah. Then Beyonce, then part. Justin. No wait, That does not sound right. Think about the Insta feed, though. Five seconds. What do you think, Ariana, Beyonce, jo Justin, Billy? Ariana, Beyonce, Justin, Billy. Final answer. That is so Correct. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Damn. Beyond, uh, Ariana Grande is 363 million. Beyonce, 302. Bieber, 283. Billy, 108. Wow. Damn. I'm a lucky. That, yeah, that, I mean, that could have literally gone anywhere. Yeah, really. Ariana, Beyonce, Justin, Billy. Yeah, and that seals the victory for them. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> yep. Congrats, guys. You guys are good. They're you guys are good. really good. Uh, we'll do the final two. So question number 14. Shout out Bex. I'm bad. I can't get a single question right in two it's weeks. Okay. Bex from New York City. This is to Rian Fran. In Gossip Girl, no. who, who was the only character to not submit a tip? Um, Rufus? I don't fucking know. 
Like, do the parents count? Like, there's oh, so many characters. I hate Gossip Girl questions. Um, 15 seconds. Um, now Rufus is kind of a slime ball. Not really. <laughs> I don't um, know. Fucking Nate, like, I could see, like, Nate just, like, not doing it. Five seconds. I'm going to go Rufus. Rufus. <laughs> it's Nate. God Finally. fucking damn it. I'm Correct. sorry. It's I'm Nate. sorry. I'm <laughs> sorry. I should have listened to you. Yeah. But, what, was, but think Alliance about it. it. Why would Rufus send in a tip? Because Rufus was a slime ball. Rufus is such a yeah. lame-o. He was such My a slime God. ball. How lame. That's so I lame. Just remember the Nate, fucking I just remember Nate everywhere. like always thinking he was like above... That. We're probably just like too lazy to He's send like, it not in. me. I never sent in a tip. Yeah. They're all like, cool. Oh my God. <laughs> Rufus, what a lame-o. Like, I'm... S- I think he said he was sleeping with like the fake cousin. Yeah. That's so fucking he, he lame. He sus for a little. That's so lame of the dad to send in a tip. <laughs> like, I'm just stuck, like, son. I know we got that wrong, but I mean, like, we lost anyway. you could have gone with Blake Lively's mom. She We're, fucking, she's, you know? But she's in the elites. You yeah. know what I mean? They're all, they're all, you know, maneuvering. Like, Rufus, I thought he was just like, oh, I'm Rufus. What a fucking lame-o. No. All right, sorry. Let's okay. Continue. I'm sorry, I should have took your answer. We it's were okay. we lost anyway, though, but yeah, I, I anyway. apologize. I should have went with Nate. Question number 15 to Carly and Taylor. Shout out. So lame. Heather from Chicago. <laughs> In Step Up, what crime did Tyler, played by Channing Tatum, commit resulting in a sentence of community service at the Maryland School of Arts? Vandalism, Vandalism. right? They broke into the auditorium and, like, wrecked it. Yeah. Final Vandalism. answer. Correct. Great movie. You gals are too good. You oh, deserve no, that one. Fire. You Very guys know good. what you're talking Final about. Final score, 7-2, Carly and Taylor. Shit, they you smoked us. us. Absolutely crushed us. Or we just watch way too yeah, much TV. <laughs> no, you no. guys are good. That we was awesome. I also watch a lot, and I knew nothing. Yep. <laughs> slow, wow. slow day. Impressive. But uh, you know what? You guys were great. Thank you so much for playing. Thanks, and now you get it. I beat Rian Fran t shirt. Yeah. So proud, proud collector of what one. happens if we keep losing? Do we have to change the name of the game? <laughs> what? Just Rian no, Fran try to us win. like trivia. <laughs> Fran, yeah. it's okay. We haven't, we still have won more but, but, times than we've lost. Yeah. No, I know that. But we haven't had a losing streak in just two weeks in it's a okay. while. Bobby Flay sometimes pressure, loses twice in a row. Week. Bobby Flay yeah. also loses sometimes twice in a row. It's okay. I don't know if he ever has. I, I've watched a couple episodes in a row where but, he has. But do you know that they were filmed in a row? That's okay. <laughs> doesn't matter what order it matters. Should, we, order air, they play should we record it? another one today <laughs> and then air this? And see yeah, it. exactly. Just like uh, put one in between. <laughs> thank you guys so much for playing. And when you get the chance, can you send Noah your sizes and addresses? So we can send yes. some over. Thank you guys so much for playing. Thank you guys. Well <laughs> done. You, you guys were great. Pop culture experts. Yeah. You guys want to host? Yes. <laughs> Go celebrate at the Natick. Yeah, you guys have dream job. Dream job. All right. Thank, thank you guys. You. Thanks, thank you. guys. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Nice thank meeting you. you. Bye.